Good morning, good afternoon, and good evening to everybody around the world watching this video. I am MightyMapper123, and this is Discord Army Men of War, a series from which where I have been letting my Discord take over the path, the future, the fate of my series. So, right here, we are located in the mountains of Grenfield. So, these, this is known as the Grenfield Rockies, and there is a green military installation and we can currently see the A-10 from the last video that's taken out the bridge which was connected to Britannia. So this is around the same time as that battle. If you didn't see it, there is going to be a link in the top where I'm going now. If you want to go and check that out. But this is the exact same plane going off to um, the, the bridge to go and blow it up. Look, we can see it's just going to take off the end of this runway. Look at it. It looks so cool. And now we have a car driving in to inform the rest of the units in this base which is one General Martinez he is the current commander of this base if we look inside over here look we can see that everything is alive look we've got planes inside this hangar we've got a dude working on something we've got GI jeans oh we also have working alongside General Martinez one Eve Eve is literally the head of the GI Jane guard which is the Queen's bodyguard he is stationed up here but anyway, as you guys know, we know that the Tans did manage to take out the airbase in Greenland. So we can see that they have uh, commandeered one of their planes right here. And they're trying to sneak it into the hangar. So they're just going to try and sneak through the door now. And we have loads, I think around 20 soldiers, 20 special forces should I say, aboard this plane. And they're going to be trying to secure this hangar. So aboard this plane... We do have one General Von Dr. Pepper, that's what I like to call him, but um, <laughs> it's, um, I, I forgot his name, what's his name, General, I, I'll get his name up right here, there we go, I forget his name every time, so we're just going to call him General Pepper, well, Captain Pepper, and he is backed up by one Bob Tan, so we, we're going to have a look at him right here, we've got two special units right here, look, one is from the Discord, you can see Mr. Pepper right there, look, and uh, we can see Mr. Bob Tanson right as well. There is a huge firefight kicking off right here. There's Bob Tanson. These are special units. These are extremely special forces from the 75th, the Manus Marauders. They're going to be assisting the Azure Legion, which is also known as the SB SBAS. And they're going to be led by one Caboose, which is Captain Caboose. He is leading a company of Blues who are down here somewhere. I'm pretty sure that the Greens might spot them though, as we do have a lot of green patrols out in the open, so we could be seeing some blue reinforcements arrive any moment. I have no idea what's going to happen in this video. But the main thing for the Tans in this video and the Blues is to secure this base, because imagine if you could secure a base and uh, you have a huge airstrip like, that, like this in somebody else's country with all of these planes. One, it stops the A-10s. Obviously, they didn't stop all of them. One of them just escaped. Imagine if it was just 10 minutes earlier, the bridge might not have been taken out by that A-10. Bob Tan right there. There's a famous Tan movie star. Turned, uh, turned commando unit. They're going to be trying to make their way through this bunker now and secure it. We've got many greens back here. Like I said, we've got Eve over here. She is uh, a one badass. It's a, it's a woman with an M60. Pretty badass. And she's got a few GI jeans back in there as well. Backed up by General Martinez, the leader of this installation. So the Tans have fully secured the main hangar area now. This is pretty good. Obviously, we can hear an alarm in the background which means that the Tans have no doubtedly alerted the local garrison of Greens, which there is a base over in that direction. In fact, I'm just going to show you really quickly if we follow this road. This is a huge map, all made by myself. And also Valentine as well. Big shout out to my team and Valentine for helping me script this mission. We just sat in a Discord chat for about 3-4 hours um, until about 5-6 o'clock in the morning trying to script this mission for you guys. It's, hard. it's how hard we work on our videos, you see. Yeah. So now everything has gone quiet. We can see that the greens out here. I have no idea what just happened in there. They don't. Need, I think it, maybe it's soundproof. I think it would be, wouldn't it, with all those rocks and stuff. But uh, the tans are now going to make their way down these hallways and finish off this hangar. I think we still have both characters active. Look, there's Mr. Bob Tan, and where's Mr. Pepper gone? I think Mr. Pepper's over here somewhere. So that's your nickname now. Um, obviously, it's Ron Cipher. That's his real name. I couldn't remember it at the start of this video. 
I, I did that in my test recording as well. So what was his name? So it's Von Cypher. He's a lieutenant, I believe. He is part of the 75th, which is Manus' Marauders, which is obviously the most elite force out of South Vietnam. Manus has now declared himself Emperor, and he wants to restore the Tan Empire. And obviously, this is the third part of Operation False Throne. So, like I say, they won at Westport with the Blues attacking the beach. They lost when they attacked the bridge. Obviously, this is about around the same time as the A-10 has just left to destroy the bridge. So that was pretty cool. Like I say, if you did miss that video, link is in the description as well. I've got one very snowed out G.I. Jane right there. Must have been out in the snow all day. All the other guys, look, they're just all pretty clean. A nice radio man and everything. These guys are on patrol. How are we doing over here? Let's see if the blues have arrived yet. So we do have some greens over here, look. We have some anti-aircraft installments as well. That, it's vital that the blues take those things out. Let's see if we can find the Captain Caboose. Of the blue SBAS. These guys look absolutely epic, look. Um, shout out to Nyrock. He is the creator of the Locking SBAS. I'm pretty sure they're known as the 82nd Airborne as well. I can't even find the leader. I hope he's not died, but we do have a special unit down here as well. Um, if the special units do die, they die. That's it. We're not going to be using them again in the series, unless, like, you guys scream at me in the comments saying, Nope, he's alive. He's just unconscious. We're just going to capture him. Just like we did with Shawshank. Oh, they've opened the door. This is not good. This could be it for the Tans inside here now. They're pinned down from both sides. We've got uh, Mr. Bob Tan right here. What's he doing? I'll tell you what, let's sneak a couple of these Tans on this. Oh no, we're going to attack from both sides. I was going to say we'll get one dude on this machine gun right here. I think that'd be pretty cool actually. Go on, you. We're going to commandeer this Jeep. Hopefully you can use the 50 cal on top, because these things are like one shot kill. How are we doing over here? We've got a hell of a lot of greens just waiting for them to come around the corner. Hard to see them, but they are there. They blend in well. Okay, this guy's got the right idea. Maybe not. He's a little bit drunk from the flight. Get lagged. Oh, where's he going? That's a wall. No, he's like, if I sit in the corner, I'm good from all angles then. He can just mount that. No, okay, that's a good strategy. No, he's changed his mind. He can't make his mind up whether he wants to drive or be on the gun. But we still have a lot of soldiers inside this hangar. We have just a handful of greens outside at the minute. I think all reinforcements have left this barracks as well, which is in the center. There's so many greens left. I wasn't expecting this many greens to be left. They've even secured the... Well, the entrance as well. And no doubtedly, they've got more reinforcements on the way. It's all up to the blues now to reinforce these tans. If they can, because I'm not seeing that many of them alive, to be honest. There's only two there. In total, there was 80 blues, which are the special blue air service. We've got trouble. Where are they all? Okay, we've got some soldiers down here. We've got three down there. And we've got another four there. I wonder where Captain Caboose is. He is somewhere among these blues. Unless they've decided to flank round this time. You just don't know with this AI. They decide to do different things every time I press the start button. Oh, here comes the green reinforcements. Those tanks have had it. This is not good for the tanks. The LAV, where is it going? You know, I worked really hard to stop the greens from going over there. What is he doing? Arrest him, court martial. Okay, the greens have secured the outside of the hangar. Oh my god, they've killed everyone. Everybody's dead. We've still got our main character though. Bob Tam, the movie star, right there. Half track outside and everything. We've got a marauder right there as well. Where is everybody else? Oh, and we still have Mr. Von Cypher as well. Mr. Dots Pepper right there. Here comes the LAV. Definitely caught Marshall in this dude. He's dropping troops off. It's not what the Tans needed, really. We really needed those blue reinforcements. But the Blues didn't make it up the mountain this time. Where are they? The main force of the Blues has to be somewhere. 
There they are. I found them. What are they doing over there? Okay, so the blues are still in the game. There's there is a huge force. I don't know how many soldiers that is. There's about 50 men there. 40 or 50 soldiers right there. And there he is, Mr. Kabusi himself. Look. This is uh, Captain Kabusi. He's the leader of this company. All of these characters are from the Discord. My admins assure me. So we've got General Martinez. The I don't know if he's still alive, actually. Let's just double check. See if Martinez is still kicking it over here. I believe he is. There he is. There's General Martinez. He is the leader of this establishment. And he is the uh, chief operator of this airfield right here. This base, which looks like it's out of James Bond slash Hoth out of Star Wars. The Tans have just around three men left now inside this hangar. What do you guys think? Tell me in the comments. Did you think it was a good plan to sneak them in by plane? I think it was. Because originally they were supposed to come in by boat, just like the SBAS did. They came in from Blutania down to Gralta, which is the central island right here on the battle map. If I remember to get it up, that is. And, uh, yeah, the Tans don't... I don't think they really could have done that. So I decided to fly them in in a green plane from the old airbase in Vietnam. So that was a pretty good plan. There's still so many greens up here, as well as an active AA gun, but the main bulk of the blue force Incoming. is sneaking up the mountains. And remember, guys, these are special forces. These have tweet, um, Rally round, uh, tw tweet stats. So these guys are, like, a little bit better than the average soldier. Where are they going? Right, okay, here we go. This is what we needed. Full advance now. It's up to these guys and Mr. Captain Kabuti to retake this airfield. I'm kind of hoping that some of these main characters survive because I'd like to use them in future videos. Okay, they seem pretty pinned down over there. How's the main airfield doing? The greens have pushed in now. Marauder versus Private with an M16, or G16 should we say. Call it the green 16. Ah, oh, no. I'm not seeing anybody else alive. Uh, okay, there's... Oh, it's both of our heroes right there. They're the last two standing as well. Oh, we've got somebody else over here. Of course. The dude in the Jeep. How can I forget about you? Right, don't worry, Sergeant. I'm going out. I'm going to sort them out. Okay, this is good. The Tans have got this place locked down. We just need the Greens to charge now. We're going to launch a counterattack from the Greens. We have a good handful of soldiers right here. All right, let's just bring them forward. I'm not going to touch them after this point right here. Hopefully they'll engage. Or not. I wonder what Stop. Captain Evie's doing. Come on, Captain Evie. There we go. Get some shots off. That's what we needed. Bob Tan, taking fire. Oh no, what's he doing? Oh, he just crashed into the wall. Never mind. <laughs> After all that, and he crashes into a wall. How did he even get there? I don't even know. That'll prevent more reinforcements. Okay, it's up to these dudes now to come and take this part of the hangar. So many soldiers have died. It looks so realistic. Well, toy realistic. There's real life realistic, then there's toy realistic. How are we doing over here? Reinforcements are still pouring into the base itself. Explosions at the top. Lock and load. That's from that anti-aircraft gun. He's just locked the area down. We've got trouble. This shotgun is sneaking up on him though. Oh, maybe not. That thing is overpowered. They just need to get some grenades over there. Wait. Dude, do you know what? I'm gonna volunteer a grenade from you. I feel like that's what they would do. Oh, he can't. Okay, that, that's why he can't throw grenades. There's a building in the way. You know what? Let's just go. Let's charge, just charge it. Let's go. You got this. That's it. That's what we wanted. Oh, there he goes. Now we can move forward. I wonder if the hero is still alive. Captain Kabusi, where are you? Okay. Well, there he is. He's down there at the minute. They're currently retreating down the mountain pass. No, they're not. They're just uh, maneuvering round. Rally round. All about strategy. Boys. Using the rocks to their advantage. We're going to get some good action on this hill now. 
I was expecting more greens to be over here. I'll be completely honest with you, right? Yeah. I say this in most videos, but during the test runs of this, it played out nowhere near the same. Every different test that we did played out completely different. And some of them I wish I recorded because we've got some really cool scenes and really good action. But like I say, with the main recording itself, I do like to do just one take. That way it makes it fair and it, it stops it from being rigged. You know what I mean? I don't want to rig my own videos. I want the AI to decide who wins and what happens next. As well as the Discord. The LED has locked them down. There's just no going down there. I wonder if Captain Kabuto can uh, get a grenade over there or something. Where is he? Got four SBAS soldiers down there. But like I say, this was around 25 tans and around 80 blues. You wouldn't think there was 80 of them, would you? But there was exactly 80 blue soldiers. Well, 81 if you include their leader. They're just not exchanging fire. Now they are. But too soon. That's it, there's two greens down. Oh, the LEV saw them. And I think that's it for the blues now. I don't think they're going to be able to advance much more. We'll leave them to it. We'll see how the tans are doing inside. I thought there was a green up there then, but it wasn't. Okay, so we still have Mr. Um, <laughs> look at him, Bob Tan right there with his cigar in his mouth. Kicking some ass. The greens are now pushing forward though to retake the rest of the hangar. I wonder if they're here really still alive. Boys. Let's see if Martinez. Martinez is still kicking it. And I'm not seeing Evie. Where's Evie gone? So, oh, there she is. There's Evie. So, like I say, Evie is a special character. She is the Queen's head of bodyguard. She was currently stationed here. She was on a task. And, uh, yeah. Now oh, she's got to try and make her way back to the, the palace and save the Queen. Actually, she's not even at the palace. She's actually in the Millie Mountains with it safe and sound. Uh, and if you're new to this series, the Millie Mountains is basically a huge Area 51 base. It looks quite similar to this, actually. But just imagine it like 10 times bigger. That's the Millie Mountains with like a giant cave inside the portal and like loads of laboratories and things like that. That's what the Millie Mountains is. Okay, so there's not really much going on over here now. We're just going to bring these greens forward. We're just going to move them to these sandbags here. I feel like that's what they would do. Push them forward. I think Bob Tanner's had it, to be honest. I don't think he's got much more left in him. Especially now we've got the main characters moving forward. Look at her, she looks awesome. Take cover. She's got a bazooka on her back, an M16 in her hands. She's probably my new favourite character in this game. I, need the key to the I hope she survives weapon. so I can use her again. It'd be awesome. On it. How are we doing over here? Is there any more blues reinforcing the area? I can't believe they've actually done, they've actually took out every blue, I think. I don't think there's any more blues left. Including Mr. Captain Kabusi. We've got one blue left, I think. I mean, we can we can just verify that really quick by having a look like that, I guess. If we just move them all over, maybe. Okay, so there's a few of them. Yeah, we've got a few left, including the captain himself. That's a good sign. We kind of just need to take this LAV out. I'm not sure if we're going to be able to do it, though. Oh, it's empty. The LAV's empty. They've abandoned ship. Okay, this could be good. This could be it now. This could be where the Blues make their stand with what's left of their troops. Get down the mountain and secure this airfield. I don't think the Greens have any more reinforcements, I don't think. And then again, they've got this right here. They've got to take out this thing. This is an anti-aircraft gun right there. And the entrance is full of soldiers. Do you know what? We're just going to pour greens in now. This is it. This is how it's going to go. We're going to pour greens into there. It's time to end this battle. The blues and the tans did try, sadly. But they didn't succeed by the looks of it. They've even got more greens down here. The greens have been doing, doing really well. I think this might be two in a row for the greens. But then again, we don't know what's going to happen yet. We just don't know what's going to happen when these blues actually engage with the rest of the units. Where are they gone? Come on, lads. You've got this. 
grab every blue around here. I don't know why they're taking so long. Speed them up. Awesome. Okay, the greens are fully secured this area. That's it now. I can't imagine that they're going to win this. Oh, the tans. I think they've had it. Who are they firing at now? Oh no! Hello! <laughs> they ambushed them! Mr. Bob Tan, the movie star. And a lone Malice Marauder. Look at that. That was awesome. Got trouble. They're splitting up. Alright, we're just gonna Over try here. and Should we try and get let's try and get a boss versus Someone boss. Else is here. That'd be pretty awesome. Yes, sir. Evie's coming around the flank now. See if we can do it. Now we're gonna leave it to it if we can. Where are you guys going? Like there's nobody here. Let's check let's check somewhere else. No, there is people here. Where are these blues gone? They've had it. I don't, uh, there they are. Okay, we've got blues. Still. We still have blues in the fight. It's okay. It's good. Oh! He's running for it. He's running. Oh, see if we can get him out there. Go, go, go. Bob Tan's doing it. It's like, oh my god, am I happy to see you guys. But what are we going to do? I don't know what we're going to do. Uh, maybe get... Yes! Get in the LAV. Your special forces. You're trained in everything. Where are you going? Soldier, get back. Can we actually do it? Yes! What a stupid thing for the Greens to do. They've literally just given up a full LAV. Now we're just going to ride this beast now into the center of here. They're going to be like, oh, it's okay, it's green. Don't worry about it. Oh, this is going to be cool to watch. Oh, this is going to be a slaughter. <laughs> this is going to be epic. Here we go. Oh, machine gun firing. Oh, he's aiming. He's literally just killed Eevee. Eevee's down. No, my favorite character. Oh, and we lost it. Well, at least we killed the Green's main character. That's the main thing. I think General Martinez is still kicking it, though. We're going to have to elect. Yep, he's General Martinez is stood right there. Look, he's still kicking it. I think we're definitely going to have to elect a new leader of the Green's Guard now. Look, she's gone. Unless she's just injured, you know. Hint, hint. Please, comments. Vote for us to still be alive. I need her in my life. My, she's the love of my life. Right, right. Let's, let's, uh, let's go. Uh, if, if I had a wife, I, I'd like her to be like her, you know, M60 and a rocket launcher. That's the kind of woman I'm looking for. Anybody out there? All right. <laughs> That's it. Lead the way. Oh, this guy is badass. Maybe this is my favorite. Bob Tan. Oh, like you can even move more like Michael Jackson. No, don't run too far. You're gonna get yourself killed, bro. No. Bob Tan. The movie stars down. Spirit body. Or not. Okay. Oh, they've had it. They have definitely had it. No, oh, here's our other dude. No, we've just lost another main character. He's still alive. He's fine. Kabusi. He's making his last stand. I kind of want to retreat him. I don't want him to die. Get out there. Get back to you. Mate. No. Kabusi's is dead. Okay, never mind. We've lost. Blues have lost. We need to get out of here before that A10 returns. No doubt he's took out the bridge so far. Nah, this, this is super cool. Yeah, this was overwhelming. Definitely. I definitely thought the Tans had it at first, but they didn't, unfortunately. The Greens still hold the airfield. I think the reinforcements just did it for them. The Blues didn't get here in time. That was the problem, I think. I think if the Blues just got here a little bit sooner... They might have stood a fighting chance. There was around what, five, maybe ten blues, which managed to get onto the airstrip itself, which is not good. Which is pretty cool, by the way. Look at this; it even ramps up at the end and everything. But yeah, the, the greens even have a base over here. Come on, this is a definite win for the greens. So, please smash that like button. Like I say, join the Might Nation if you're new. Check out all the links in the description, such as my website. I'm going to be doing a lot with my website soon. I'm thinking of actually producing my own line of toy army men let me know what you guys think in the comments and would you buy some if um if i was to like make my own brand of toy army men i think it'd be pretty cool you know and uh, so I'm, I'm thinking about upgrading my merch store soon and uh yeah so become a patreon as well if you want to support the channel 
and get exclusive rewards, buy some Mighty Map of 1, 2, 3 and Army Men of War merch. You know, all this helps me keep doing what I'm doing. And yeah, other than that, just please subscribe and also like the video. And yeah, I will see you all in the next episode.